Well, isn't this an interesting turn of events? What's up guys, real quick, we just got a major, what I think is a major Halloween movie update for 2018. It's like they top themselves, then they top themselves, then they top themselves, then they sink back a little bit, then they top themselves again. This is really interesting though. Original stunt actor for Michael Myers, Nick Castle himself, is playing Michael Myers again in Halloween 2018 which makes the two movies, the original and this one, even more of a, of a like a double feature, of a true continuation because it's the same Laurie Strode and it's the same Michael Myers. Now keep in mind, there were quite a few actors that actually played Myers in the first movie, but Nick Castle is the guy that gets the most credit. He's the guy that really has the walk that we all know and love, uh, the build that we all know and love he just wears it well. Now this comes from bloodydisgusting.com and they also say that uh, a James Jude Courtney will also be playing Myers. I'm thinking this is for more of some of the action scenes. Uh, you know, you need a, a really good stunt double because Nick Castle, he's in his 60s now. So you definitely want to keep your main actor safe. But wouldn't it be really interesting if Tony Moran came back, if Myers was somehow unmasked again? That's a bad idea, forget that. Also in other news, uh, Academy Award winning makeup and effects artist Christopher Nelson who's done like Deadpool he's also done some of the Kill Bill movies um, but he's a pretty big name in Hollywood for visual effects so what that means for Halloween I don't know but it, it, it sounds like it's gonna be good and guys just remind everybody uh, writer Danny McBride and David Gordon Green they are sticking to the the credo that they want this movie to be really dark really grim really heavy uh, and really tension filled like the first movie this is not gonna be a gore fest this is gonna be an exercise in tension. And I believe if they pull this off, this will be huge, huge. John Carpenter is doing the score. It's almost like a dream crew doing this movie. And more importantly, I don't think anything's holding us back now. We're full speed ahead. I think come October, we're getting a new Halloween movie on the big screen and I can't wait. But they haven't started shooting yet. Production starts in January right now. Please don't let them delay this thing anymore because then that's gonna push it back to possibly 2019. Now I know there's some complaints that uh, Nick Castle is in his 60s, but keep in mind guys, Sylvester Stallone is in his mid 70s. And the guy pumped out uh, another Rambo movie back in 2008 when he was in his 60s. So really age isn't an issue for this. Plus if Michael is like full on supernatural, then it's really not gonna matter. So anyway guys, post your comments below. What do you think about this? Are you still excited about this movie? Um, I know I am, I can't wait. I'm a Halloween fanatic. Can't get here quick enough. Also guys, come over to Killer Flicks where we talk horror all day and every day. If you want you a Drum Dums t-shirt, go to the Drum Dums shop. You can get a Drum Dums t-shirt, you can get a Killer Flicks t-shirt. Also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Letterboxd, and now Stardust. If you like what I'm doing, hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, and Drum Dum out.